What up, NFT fam? Let's look at some updates. Um, let's see where we left off last. Um, I talked about this, the Atom Bomb Squad um, Twitter space. So I was there listening to Gary V. Um, what did he say that stuck out to me? Pretty much the same thing as always, which was kind of like, just be mindful in the NFT space. That's all I can remember. And that we're early and like, you know, concepts like, I think he talked about patience. I don't know. I've been listening to the podcast today, so I, I can't tell. Like I should have done this recording like right after I listened to it so I wouldn't forget. But it was just nice to hear him talk on a Twitter space. Um, what was this? He's talking about, he gave a shout out to this NFT hash bastards on that video. Um, V friends two is coming out quarter one. I think it's going to be under a thousand dollars. I'm definitely going to buy one if I can. Um, let's see what else. Crypto Mori's went all the way to like 14 and they're kind of like at 11 right now. So if we are talking in terms of stocks, then they kind of broke out and they're back at support. I'm expecting them to keep going. I would like them to keep going. <laughs> so I'm excited for that. Uh, what else? What else? What else? I was listening to the, the podcast today, the Gary Vee podcast. And on a few of them, he said November 17th at 12 p.m. Eastern, there is a surprise in the V friends discord, the stage, you know, where people talk. Um, so that's, that I'm excited about. And then I also saw that he was saying that for his birthday, November 14th, he's going to be giving away an original V friends drawing in the discord. So be in the discord, November 14th and 17th. I don't know what time on the 14th for his birthday, but, um, I went to the AT&T store to wait for my new phone because I haven't had a, a new phone in like a bunch of years and like it was broken and all this shit like people could call me but I couldn't pick up and, and speak <laughs> so I needed a new one and so I, I got a piece of paper because I had to wait like a couple hours for the, the shit to transfer in the store and you know without your phone you kind of feel like weird like we're so we're so into the phone the, the min any minute of boredom it's like phone. So lucky I had piece of paper, piece of paper, piece of paper and um, a pen. And I was just drawing some ideas. So I actually wrote A, T and T, A, T and T. And I made it into a face. Um, I have this whole thing about like flowers and like, you know, heads being like vegetation almost. Um, because some people are like, like the, this concept of like some people are like weeds that grow in your garden or um, like your mind is like a garden. So you got to be careful what ideas you put into it because they can grow. So I really love that idea. Uh, I actually sold a piece of real artwork, which was just kind of like positive writing one day in Queens, like several, several years ago, I want to say like maybe 10 years ago. So if I ever blow up as an NFT artist, like there will be one person with an original artwork of mine that will probably be worth a lot. Anyway, um, Gary V here is talking, I'm going to be giving away an original V friends on my birthday this Sunday in the discord. So that's exciting. I don't know what time he also uh, tweeted this. So Kerry Washington said, these are stunning. She's talking about world of women. She made a tweet and he's like, well, I'm telling y'all world of women was always a play real talent behind it. And one of the few I believe in and bet on, there will always be a lot more of these types of tweets to come as the 99% enter the space. It's exciting times for blue chips. So he thinks world of women is a blue chip and like the more and more celebrities that come in, the less there's going to be available, the more the price is going to go up, all this stuff. So I would actually like to buy a world of women and an iPad. <laughs> so I listed my space punk with rocket fuel for one ETH. Um, it's right here, rocket fuel. They are still figuring out what they're going to do with rocket fuel, but this one has it and it's like listed that way. And I hope somebody buys it so that I could put some money towards a world of women and towards an iPad. Um, also somebody, uh, put this up. Airbnb CEO shared this on Twitter. They look like little like metaverse squares. So Airbnb 2021 winter release, November 9th. That was yesterday. So what is this? I don't know. Not anymore. 
Well, it would be cool if they did have an NFT space. It sucks this was yesterday. Like, I got to research this now. Oops. <laughs> and then Andrew Wang, he put up, he made this. This is my first ever one of one, and I'm grateful that such kind and good people have been bidding. This is up to one ETH. It's called Statue of Catterty because it's a cat. It's so cute. Like, I was like, oh my God, I love the name. It looks adorable. Like, I told him, please make more. They're so cute. So I think he's going to be a successful NFT artist. Like it's, it's kind of like cool cats, but like totally zoomed out almost like it's adorable. I love it. Um, also Beeple, he sold another piece of artwork for another insane amount. Like his first was like 69 million. This is 29 million. Like Beeple is legit artist now, like legit, like he's like making money, like Picasso type money. So incredible, incredible. Um, Disney launched on VV the other day and I saw this tweet where somebody said floor price for Mickey Sorcerer's hat is 1.2k wish I had bought more when I had the chance I wish they would have dropped on OpenSea like I'm not really familiar with VV but I think they didn't have a lot of gas and maybe that's why they went with it but I gotta start like yo this space is moving so quickly where it's like holy fucking shit I like I can't keep up like my brain like you know, learning can be hard sometimes. Like I gotta, Oh, I gotta learn fucking VV now. I gotta keep up with shit. Like it's fucking overwhelming. Honestly, like, you know how like you play a video game and like you get used to it and then it's like, Oh shit, there's this new level or something. Like you gotta be constantly leveling up in this space to keep up with everything. So this was his tweet, people's tweet. Holy sh Holy fuck. Insanely honored to be in this collection. Like, this is crazy shit. And I saw this too. I thought this was, this is like another, so, okay, let's talk about um, combo projects, combo derivatives. I think that's what I called it the other day. It's projects that are the combination of two projects. So this literally looks like a cool cat upside down um, with creatures, you know, like obviously like drawn over and shit, but you know, with the eyes and the mouth, maybe I can't tell, <laughs> or maybe not, but it's a creature ups. I mean, it's a, it's a, <laughs> It's a cool cat upside down with creature colors. And I, th what is it called? Um, it's called catchers <laughs> here. Creator of catchers. So funny. Like such a good play. Like I love shit like this. Like remember when I showed you guys the board ape doodle club. So they have since had a change. I'm going to show you. They are now called the society of derivative apes. So remember how it said Bored Ape Doodle Club trademark? So that totally changed. Now it's Society of Derivative Apes. So interesting, <laughs> but they are adorable also. I love combo projects. So, 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 so cute. I love it. Um, and I think that's it for my update for now. I'm just like cruising Twitter and seeing what's interesting. I would say learn VV if you can. This is adorable. Um, I got to explore that. Like if you have money, <laughs> buy this off of me so I could have one ETH. Okay. Thanks so much. <laughs> Love you. <laughs> um, and be in the fucking discord this Sunday, November 14th to celebrate Gary V's birthday and also November 17th for that stuff. And um, when I get that iPad, I'm going to make start fucking making crazy ass fucking shit. Um, my artwork has always been fucking weird as hell. So I'm, it's kind of like weird that now I'm going to have this platform. I'm excited about it. And that's all for now. <laughs> Bye guys. I hope you have a good night. Oh, remember just, I always fucking want to say this in the beginning and I always say at the end. Okay. Please like this video, please subscribe and please leave a comment. I'm actually going to show you, um, my page and the difference you guys can make in my life. So in one of these one of these projects or videos, like, like when you guys start leaving comments, I get up to 1k views. That is so fucking cool. I think I really like started yelling <laughs> on one of these videos. Hold on a second. I got to find it. I think it was about the frogs or what the hell was it on? Hold on. I'm going to find it. Yo, this one. Okay. Zombie toads. I gave a clear announcement. I was like, please leave a comment. Okay. I was like, please leave a comment on both of these and like the video and look 1.1 K and 1.14.
I mean, 1.4K. Like when you guys like the video and leave a comment, it helps me so much. Like these other videos, I'm putting out videos, but like if you don't leave a comment and you don't leave a like, like nobody watches it. I'm trying to, I'm trying to be out there. Okay. Anyway, I hope you have a good night. Let me know what you think of this and I'll see you guys next time. Oh, a last side note, Abagachi land is still holding up at 140. So that's awesome. And I was looking at my, um, my pajama shirt. I bought it for 30 ghosts. It's already gone up, uh, 10, 10 times two. It's already got $20 for the, for the lowest listing. So that was cool. I mean, fucking shit. It's very cool. All right. Now I'm going to leave. Okay. Bye.